Diddy has shared another proud father moment as his baby daughter, Love Combs, took her first steps ahead of her first birthday. On Tuesday, October 10, Puffy shared an adorable clip of watching his youngest child take her first steps over FaceTime with her mother Dana Tran. Wow. Baby, you walking? Oh my god, you did it, kid. You did it, he encouraged love and amazement. Love shuffled along the carpet in a white blouse and seemed confused to hear her dad's voice coming from the phone while he wasn't actually in the room. In his comment section, Diddy received plenty of love from friends such as N.O.R.E., Busta Rhymes, and Genuine, with the latter writing, It's the best feeling ever king. I know you know, congrats. Dad life. Baby Love will be celebrating her first birthday on October 15. Back in May, Diddy shared that she spoke her first words, Dada. Breaking news. Baby Love has just said her first words. She said, Dada. Let's go twin flame. I also won the bet. I hope you all are having a beautiful Sunday. Hashtag proud dad. Love, he wrote in the caption. However, while many saluted Diddy on daddy duty, others accused him of attempting to change the subject and get the spotlight off the growing speculation of him being involved in Tupac's 1996 murder. 50 Cent lit the fuse earlier this week when the G-Unit mogul claimed that the late rap legend's killing was ordered by Puff, who he advised to lawyer up. Damn, so Pac got lined by Brother Love, he wrote, referencing Diddy's R&B moniker. LOL, time to lawyer up, shit might get sticky. 50's post included a photo of two Pac and Suge Knight sitting in the black BMW sedan the night of the deadly drive-by shooting on September 7, 1996. It's unclear what prompted 50 Cent's wild post, but speculation has long circulated that Diddy was somehow involved in Tupac's murder. He has never been arrested or charged in connection with the crime, and he has vehemently denied the allegations. The rumors largely rest on comments made during a 2008 police confession by Dwayne Keith D. Davis, who was charged with Pac's long unsolved murder last month. The 60-year-old former Southside Compton Crip told detectives that he and Puff had discussed a $1 million deal to kill both Tupac and Suge Knight, who were feuding with Diddy's bad boy records at the time. Davis claimed that the Harlem-bred mogul told him during a meeting at Greenblatt's Deli in Los Angeles that he wanted to get right of them dudes. After Pac's death, however, Keith D. said that the Southside Compton Crips never received the alleged $500,000 payment from the record executive.